Kwan Ye Vini and Highland Springs with a chance to take home the state championship game in an epic final against the Maury Commodores. And this guy was lights out money. Brian Alexander. We had an Alexander for Loudoun County. This Alexander, even better. Springers doing their job. Yeaman like work on the boards. Danzel Cole. Oh, Maury would hold their own on the rebounding position as well. There's Alexander again. Three more. Alexander had 19 points in the first half alone. Dorian Davis with an answer down low for two. This was a back and forth game throughout, however. Inside, Adrian Newton connects. And then just, just sheer force, strength, willpower, you name it. Get it to go, Latrell Sutton. It ain't nothing. He would deal with foul trouble early, so the Springers had to play most of this game without his presence on the court. No matter, Springers always find a way. Denzel Coles, 10 for 20, shot 50% from the field. Not quieting down Brian Alexander, though. He connects for two, had 28 total points on the night for the Commodores. More Commodores, here they come. Oh, no! Defense to offense. Sutton, it ain't nothing, I'm blocking it. And then inside, who else but Juan Ye Beanie connecting down low for two. And then Vini did a lot of his work with his assists. Finds a man in the corner that would be paramount later. Denzel Coles connects for three. We're tied at 18. Yeah, that's just one quarter play. Highest scoring quarter. We go to the second. Because Moore has a great defense, and they would really pin down the Springers later in the game. But Alexander still finding his. Moore going on a little bit of a run. Here's Alexander again. Again, two of his 19 points. He also had eight rebounds to go along with it. Springers had an answer for everything, though. Three ball up and good money for Danzel Coles. 30 for Coles. Star of the game? Maybe. But maybe Christian Martin would be in a small but very significant way. Connects for two. Vini on the charge. His assists were key for Highland Springs. Corner three ball. Money ball is good. Dorian Davis connects from long range. And Maury looked good, but Highland Springs had a three-point lead at the break. Third quarter. Springers looking to add on. They would. High jumper. Well done. Well defended. Better offense. Davis. Again, two of his, 16. Davis and Cole combined for 46. But Maury started getting their offensive rebounds going. Number 32, Kair Pendleton for two. But watch what happens. In the break, Highland Springs saying, we're not letting your defense get set. It is Coles again for three. Springers on the move once again. Coles deep. Got it. Denzel Coles. Money. Again, 30 points on the night. And plenty of rebounds to go with that. Maury, however, getting it going. And Adrian Newton had a huge game, 18 points himself. Maury would have a two-point lead after three. And in the fourth quarter, Maury would grab their largest lead of the game. That's right, Newton. Fig scoring down low. Newton, the floater. No. Offensive rebound. Looks like Maury is taking the willpower over Highland Springs. More from the Commodores. This doesn't feel like the Springers' night anymore. Maury up seven late with the two from Brian Alexander. Springers need a big play in a big way, and they need it in a hurry, and they get it. It is Sutton who comes off the bench after facing four fouls, two point play. And then three-point play the old fast week. He can the free throw later. Springer still down. Christian Martin. Big plays late. Kmart, quarterback for Island Springs in football. Big plays late in basketball. More Highland Springs still down in this one. That would get him within three. That two for Danzel Coles. But watch out. Maury up one. Just under a minute to go. Now they're up three. Springer's got to hurry. 30 seconds to go. Vini, what are you going to do? Vini to the corner. He finds Dorian Davis. Three ball ties it up. We're all knotted up. Tied. All of a sudden, the Springers looked like they were left to dead. Late in the fourth. Last chance, Maury. Rebound, no. The putback, no good. Fell on the rebound, Christian Martin. 
with seven seconds to go. 62-62, Martin to the free throw line. Needs hit one. Bank is open. Got it. Springer's up one. Here comes the second. Off the back iron. Tipped around. Maury's got it. One last chance for three. No. Rebound. No. Springers survive. Springers win it. Springers take home the championship. 63-62. Christian Martin makes the play. An unbelievable finish. They look dead to rights, but they hoist the hardware and they earn the state championship. It's just one of those nights and one of those things. I, you know, we just we are, I believe we're a team of destiny. Uh, we're a prayerful team, and you know, we kind of carry it that way. You know, we just rely on our faith to really prevail in a lot of games. But this has definitely been one of the toughest opponents we've had all year defensively. Me and Christian have played a big, um, as, had a big aspect on this team. Being that we just came in, we just, we just made the best of it. Being that we football players, we just came into basketball happy, joyful. Just being able to team bond with each other made us um, happy.